How much has the Asia X Japan REITs market grown over the last 20 years? Since 2002, when the first REIT in this region was offered, the Asia X Japan REIT market has grown over 50 times and is one of the fastest growing asset classes, both in terms of depth and breadth of offerings. After so much growth, is there any left? Emerging and developing Asia is expected to pose stronger than average GDP growth into 2024. This will drive demand for commercial and logistic properties and underpin rental growth. Investors can participate in this via the Nikko AM Straits Trading Asia X Japan REIT ETF. The outlook for key sectors in Asia X Japan remains favorable. Key themes include above average tertiary industry growth. The definition of a tertiary industry refers to the part of the country's economy concerned with the provision of services, and a strong return to office trend in Asia, which surpasses that of US and EU. As of 8 of June 2023, results and business updates show positive year-on-year -year rent reversion for most major REITs. 8 of June 2023 reported data from REITs show that the underlying fundamentals remain stable. Most major REITs reported positive year-on-year -year rent reversion for their portfolios. What about interest rates? How do most major Asia X Japan REITs fare in a rising interest rates environment? There is a limited impact of rising interest rates on profits and dividends since a large proportion of debt, about 71%, is pegged to fixed rates. The negative impact on the dividend per unit DPU, for the major REITs is estimated at between 1.5% to 3.3% for major Singapore and Hong Kong REITs for every 100 basis points rise in interest rates. Factors that affect the DPU impact are the level of gearing and percentage of debt pegged to fixed rates. With favorable supply and demand dynamics, positive rental reversions should help negate the downward impact of higher interest rates. In summary, the GDP growth outlook for Asia X Japan is expected to outpace that of the US and EU into 2024. Combined with favorable demand supply dynamics, rental growth projections in key sectors remain strong. While interest rates remain elevated, most REITs have a high proportion of fixed rate debt. Hence, growth in rentals should mitigate the downward impact of higher interest costs. However, investors should note that as REITs derive their income primarily from rentals, factors leading to a fall in rental income would does have a detrimental impact on both distribution and asset values. Some examples include an economic downturn or a higher than expected rise in interest costs. To find out more, visit nicoam.com.sg slash reads.